Brief poetry reading by Justin Bidiello. I don't like to dwell on the same theme, but for the survivors of this night, I'd like to read uh, a couple of poems that I've translated from the work of the Italian nonviolent revolutionary Danilo Dolci, uh, then a couple of my own, uh, and then finally one more by Dolci. The first, in fact, dealing with Hiroshima. There's one obscurity in this. Perhaps some of you know that after the, the bomb dropped, uh, it was decided to reclaim the city. So there was a little contest, uh, sort of a mafia uh, dealing and wheeling dealing about who would get the contract. So that's the slight obscure reference. Ten in a hundred adults from Hiroshima don't know. Percentage is higher in Japan as a whole. And what about the rest of the world? An old city with poor and rich folk, they've rebuilt it with walls, random houses, bowing to the model that won the contest. Bow tie tightening, coca colaizing, rocking to the cams of the soul, pastel pink spaghetti and fish in showcase plastic, intimate vibrators for single women, and the public convenience rinses itself photoelectrically. In the eye of the extermination, they've laid out gardens where doves perch and slumber around goldfish ponds, and the fountains always gurgle near the memorial museum. They should have left the gangrene intact, the rooms, the clocks melted, saying 8.15, when flesh was burning, clothes fusing with skin, roof tiles and bottles liquefying, ancient china dissolving, iron singeing like grass, a fire gnawing even the rocks. And whoever covered eyes from the glare smelted into hands. Intact, they should have left the trademark, little boy, designed with the most refined techniques, projected in its parabola to sow cancer. They've nursed new grass with rose bushes, donated by worldwide philanthropists, instead of inviting everybody to meditate. They tried to cover the gash, but this was a wound to leave open. Real estate is high. We have to find another site. Airfare is high too. But what is the price of life? My mother doomed me to a name that means just, uh, and I couldn't think of any good definition of justice except Book of Job, which most of you I'm sure have read. Um, so most of these poems are about the question uh, of injustice and how to fight it. Maybe you could just uh, basically tell us who you are, uh, your background as a and how you could be here. 